Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So today's video I'm going to be doing an outdoor installation for Halloween. So I've already got the balloons blown up from my Halloween balloon wall that I did about a week ago, two weeks ago, I can't even remember. Um, so I'm going to just be taking those outside just to jazz the front of the house up a little bit because the children on our road are going to be like having a look at all the decorations because they can't trick or treat. So I want to make it really special. Um, it's really annoying though because I did have a massive bag of Halloween stuff and I cannot find it anywhere. So that's annoying but I will try and make the most of what I've got and I will show you how I um, install outdoors <laughs> because I get a lot of questions asked how do I attach what about the weather all these kind of questions so I will be answering all those in this video so let's get started I'm gonna move all the balloons indoors and then I will set you up on a time lapse and do some kind of close-ups of how I attach things and so on and so on <laughs> thing about outdoor installations is that you use what is around you to help you so if there is a gutter if there is a, a gutter I mean like a drain pipe if there is like um, a window or a branch or a tree or anything like that then use that um, to your advantage I've got my where my door number is I'm just gonna use that to attach it so I've just got my 260 here I'm just going to wrap it round make sure it's really tight just like always do like a check before like and make sure that there's loads of secure um attachments to the walls and stuff like that to make sure that it's all safe and secure <laughs> Thank you. 
So I tried to film as much as I possibly could. So I attached it using um, two 60 cues and I used every little nook and cranny that I could find um, so it's super super secure because that's the thing with outdoor garlands you've got to make sure weather permitting so for example it's a really windy day you're going to want at least five minimum um, attachment points so I have skimmed through all of mine made sure it's nice and attached and now I thought I would answer some questions that I've been asked on my Instagram now I get asked about outdoor installations a lot and it's not been my strong point when I was when I, when I had started and um, so the, the thing is it's trial and error and it's just learning that you've got to attach it to something now if it's a completely plain brick wall and there is literally no attachment points then sometimes using a little stand or a little frame just as the base is a really really big help so if you have got like a um, nut lamp stand or you've got a pipe and drape frame they are great because they're weighted and they're perfect for this kind of outdoor installation um, so I also make sure that I double stuff my balloons when they're outside because when the it is too cold or too hot or it's really sunny or it's raining it's so much more easier for the balloons to become damaged or expand and pop or shrink or anything can happen with the balloons outside so I always over double stuff over inflate take all the air back out and then blow it back up again so that's just another little tip um, to give a tr to give it a try I can't talk today <laughs> um, so yeah let me know if you find this video helpful and I will see you in the next one